Hey guys, it's Ad Hat America. So, the last two weeks I have been playing Fallout 4, and I love it. I've been waiting to put a video up, uh, just kind of playing. I got lost in the game. Uh, and I also got Battlefront at the same time, so I've just kind of been everywhere. But, um, yeah, this is the first video going up for Fallout 4. I've been doing some stuff in this game. I've been grinding really hard in this game, just doing everything I can to make this video as awesome as possible. So... There's going to be some slight spoiler alerts, nothing really. I mean, the game is based on every, different decisions that you make, so your experience is going to be completely different from what I show you in this video. So, but, yeah, just go ahead and play the game. Pick this game up. This is game is not uh, this game is not a flop like Battlefront. Like, Battlefront is not worth the kind of money that you're going to drop on this game. So go out, pick this game up as soon as you can. I hope you guys enjoy the video and enjoy the music that's being played in the video. It is my personal music from my music collection, from my guitars, from my hands. So enjoy it and have fun with the video. And I'll talk to you guys after the show. So here we have all of the power armor pieces that I scavenged from different men. I killed over 30 men to gather these pieces, and they will remain in my possession until the day I die. This barn was built handmade by me so that I could hold these power armor pieces. Each one contains the soul of a soldier that I shot dead. He's, he dared to trifle with the Brotherhood of Steel, and he won. This, the victory is mine, and all mine. View my victory as I show you my power armors, scavenged from the dead bodies of the Brotherhood of Steel. Many a good man put up a fight, but it was no, to no avail. I was able to take each one of them down and scavenge their armor. This armor from a raider. This armor from a soldier. Dead in the field. This armor from another soldier dead in the field. Several of these... I did not simply kill these men, but these men were found in the fields. Already killed by the terrors of the wasteland. I simply scavenge their parts. They hold their souls and their memories, their honor and their duty. Each suit holds a name. It is up to you to carry on these names by finding each one of these suits in this game. Good luck. Folks these days count on violence to solve their problems. Only up to
This area seems to be in disarray. I wonder if this is recent. through it could prove beneficial. gentle a word. These monstrosities are just another example of man blindly taking a step forward only to wind up stumbling two steps back. I've been fighting for years, trying to put a stop to this madness. And just when I thought we were getting the upper hand, along come the synths. I've seen what these super mutants do to people. Can you imagine what the synths would be like if they ever got the upper hand? It would be Armageddon repeated. And maybe the end of everything hold dear. Back? I wouldn't be here if it weren't for your two sickening games, Jean. Ought to tell her to write home then. Oh, poor little Valentine. A shame you got beat up by a girl. I'll just run back home to daddy, shall I? Should have left her alone, Lady Jean. This ain't the old neighborhood. In this vault, I'm king of the castle, you hear me? And I ain't letting some private dick shut us down now that I finally got a good thing going. I told you we should have just killed him! But then you'd have to get all sentimental. All that stupid crap about the old times. Dala! 
I'm handling this. Ginny Malone's always got things out of control. Oh, yeah? Then what's this guy doing here, huh? Valentine must have brought him here to rub us all out. Darla, listen to me. You have a home to go back to. You don't want to throw your life away with these thugs. I... I... You're right! What am I doing? I've gotten all mixed up. Darla! Where... Where, where are you going? Home, Skinny. Where I should have been all this time. This is goodbye, for us. Oh, come on, Nikki. You cost me my men. Now you and your friend cost me my girl. My friend here just did you a favor, Ginny. You always did have bad taste in women. Now that she's not around to feed that temper of yours, maybe you'll see sense and let us walk. You still owe me for two weeks in the hole. You slow, overconfident ass. Get out of here! All right, you get to the town at 10. I still see your face after that. I'm gunning both of you down. Things can go from calm to deadly in a heartbeat. Now you 